Shabbat Shalom, Temple Sinai. This Shabbat we celebrate as we read Jacob's story of the dream. Jacob lays down for the night and he sees this ladder, a stairway going up to heaven. Yes, that's where Led Zeppelin got the idea. And the stairway sees angels going up and down, up and down. Now, Jacob doesn't quite know what to do with all of that. Part of it is, it's one thing if he sees angels coming down from heaven. He sees angels going back up, then it's a different story because now all of a sudden that means the angels are hanging around among us. And Jacob gets confused. Who are the angels? Which ones are the people who deserve extra treatment and who deserve extra kindness? And Jacob learns pretty quickly, ah, we need to treat everybody specially. We need to treat everybody as if they're an angel. Even the person who's the jerk in the car next to us cutting us off on the road. That becomes a hard lesson to learn. And Jacob wakes up from the dream and says, God was in this place and I didn't know it. And that in fact is what we have to do. We have to find a way to open our eyes to realities that we might not be able to see. God might exist all over the place. There might be angels everywhere we look. The question is, do we have the right lenses to see them? Can we see what's going on? And so this Shabbat will celebrate as we study Jacob, but also as we study that challenge for us as humans, how to see the world with different eyes, with better eyes, with sharper eyes, with kinder eyes. I hope you'll join us. Services Friday evening are at 7, Saturday morning, Torah study at 8.30, services at 9.15, Sunday morning next door, um, and throughout the week, the usual assortment of classes, Parsha Shavua on Wednesday, um, Intro to Judaism is Thursday evening, uh, Meditation Wednesday evening, and all of the usual assortment of committee meetings and centers meetings and all of those kinds of things. For now, though, a Shabbat of dreaming and a Shabbat of seeing the world filled with holiness and a Shabbat of an awakening and recognizing that holiness is all around us. Look forward to seeing you at the temple soon. Shabbat Shalom.